You want to play? Oh, I was going to show you Miggy laying up. I Every time I turn on the camera, Miggy runs to me. I was going to show you. I was vacuuming and I threw the dog beds up on the chair and Miggy was laying in them. But he always runs to me every time he hears the noise of the camera when it turns on. It's so funny. <laughs> Anyways, I just want to show you guys, the boys got their summer haircuts. They are totally shaved down, and I don't care to all of you who thinks it's crazy to shave them down. My boys get shaved down in the summer because my boys play outside all the time, and they get dirty, and everything sticks to their hair when it's long. Um, the day I shaved them down, it had rained the night before, and... They were bringing in so much grass clippings <laughs> uh, in the in their hair. Oh, it was just driving me nuts. I'm like, it's time for a shave down. So, yes, Marley has his racing straight back. Miggy has one, too. Miggy, come here. I want to show him something on you. Come here. Come here, baby. Um, if you remember me telling you that Miggy has some little um, bumps on him. They're like little cysts. They're nothing, uh, they're nothing um, to be worried about. But look at They look like... Go on, leave him alone. See those dark spots right here? Here, they look like little moles. Like where the bump is, it's like the hair is dark. Let's see here. Yeah, I don't know if, maybe it ain't the hair. Anyways, he looks like he has little moles on him <laughs> from his little bumps. Yeah, so I don't like that when he shaved down but they'll be cooler they were panting so hard the other day um it was really hot out and uh they were panting like crazy and yes um i'm gonna answer this question magnum is a tad taller than the other boys um i think he weighs about the same i haven't had him to the vet yet he's not due for any um shots or checkups or anything so I don't know how much he weighs right now, but I'm assuming he's about the same weight as the others. But he does stand a little bit taller than the other boys. So yes, he's, I guess he's a little bit bigger in height than the other boys, but not really um, weight. So there, there's Marley. <laughs> oh, I got somebody in the dog beds. <laughs> Mickey was just laying there so comfortable earlier. And Marley, when he, um, somebody noticed he seemed darker when his hair was longer, he is. When he gets shaved down, he's very light. Very light. Yes. And I used a number um, 10 blade on them. The body, the head, the legs, everything. So, yeah, so they got their summer hairdos going on. And I have to get to the store. I'm going to Hobby Lobby to get a case for my husband's father's flag that was on his casket at his funeral. Oh, and I wanted to show you guys the um, shadow box I made for my grandma. Let's move these. See if you can see it in there. It might have a glare because of the glass. Let me take it out of there. I shared it on my Facebook page, but I thought I'd show it to you guys who don't have a Facebook. Let's see, maybe if I sit it here, you can see it better. Um, the paper that has her name on it, that is the, um, what do, what do you want to call it? They handed it out at her funeral to let you know kind of what was going on and it has hymns and stuff in it. Are they called hymns? Um, I'm not Catholic, so <laughs> I'm not sure what they're called, but it has a program, kind of like a program, I guess. That's behind, um, the photos and stuff. And then my grandma's, uh, graduation photo. And then my grandma, I think this was at my cousin's bridal shower. She's got like a little ribbon from her package hanging on her hair there. And then the memorial card that was in her, at the funeral home. Um, these are dried little roses that were in the flowers we purchased um, and had sent to the funeral home. And then the little tag that was on our flowers in there, so. I think it turned out nice and I can pass that down to my kids um, later on in the years and there's a picture um, of my grandma and I when I was little look at that beehive going on <laughs> and then my, my picture here I'm sorry I'm kind of going down memory lane with you guys and this is a dog channel but 
And then here's my Grandma Smith. She's kind of got the same hairdo going on, don't she? Look at that. <laughs> it's my Grandma Smith with me. My dad and I. And my mom and I. So anyways, um, yeah, so I need to go get a case for that. I need to go to the grocery store. I feel like... Ever, April is when my grandma went in the hospital. She was there for oh, a week and a half, two weeks, I can't remember. And then the um, time she was in there, she and then she passed. And April just seems like it was the longest month of my life and the hardest month of my life. And then it seems like May, it's already, what is today? Is today the 13th? Let me see. What is today? Today is the 15th. <laughs> uh, I just, it seems like this month is just going by way too fast. And I feel like I just, I'm usually organized and I'm on top of things. And I just, I feel like I just can't, look at this. <laughs> I feel like I just can't get in back into like a routine. It's, it's driving me nuts. So I really don't usually groom all five dogs in one day, but I was like, I got to get this done. It's driving me nuts how they smell like dirt and grass constantly. I washed all their bedding um, from their crates while I was grooming them. And I just got it done. And I'm like, today I got to get to the grocery store. I have to get this house filled back up with groceries. Um, and I got to take my son to get his hair cut. His last day of his, uh, he's a senior. His last day of school is Friday this week, the 18th. Um, I'm waiting for his graduation announcements to come in the mail. He's not having an open house or um, I don't know if they call it an open house all throughout the country but or a graduation party. He's not having one. Um, he's not the type who likes to be center of attention um, at all. So he did not want a graduation party. So I don't have to stress over that like I did when my daughter graduated. Um, we are helping him get a car for his graduation present. Um, or he's going to take over my car and I'm going to get a different car. I'm not sure yet. We'll see how money is. Um, so he's his graduation is on June 10th. Um, so waiting for those to come in the mail and get those addressed and mailed out. So yeah, it's just been the past month and a half has just been crazy. And I know my videos have been kind of lackluster, at least to me. You guys probably don't think so, but I noticed I'm not getting as many views. I don't know if it's just because people just aren't watching anymore or what. Or maybe you guys just like these kind of videos where I just kind of show what's going on through the day. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but it's been, uh, I've been trying to keep up on the videos and trying to make them worth uh, watching, so... It's just been a crazy past month and a half and hopefully things after my son graduates and summer kicks in, it can just be relaxing and I can just get, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> you got your squirrel? You got your squirrel? Huh? You got your squirrel? Yeah, that's a squirrel. This is a squirrel. <laughs> Don't get my hand. Get the squirrel. <laughs> oh, now he don't care. He saw something outside. So anyways, I'm going to go um, and get my shopping done, and then I'll be back. I was thinking about it, and I didn't mention in the last clip that my daughter is also moving out in June. She's moving in with a friend that she, um, a girlfriend, not a guy friend, thank goodness, or I'd even be more of a wreck. <laughs> But um, she's moving in with a friend who she met through work and they become good friends. Um, the friend, already, she got the apartment in her name and she's already moving in. But my daughter um, was waiting until she could have a couple more paychecks under her belt to have a month's rent saved up um, and bills. So that way, if something happens, uh, she loses her job or there's... Um, she's sick or something she's got extra money um so she don't have to worry about paying her bills so she's smart that way so yeah so i've been stressed out about my daughter moving out and um 
you know, all that and the worries that go along with that. So anyways, I'm here. Oh, I'm showing you guys the sky. <laughs> I'm here at Hobby Lobby. And I'm going to go in and get that case for my husband's dad's flag. And uh, then go grocery shopping. So I'll be back. I'll show you what I get. Okay, all done shopping. Took my son to get his hair cut. And got the boys some bully sticks. As you can see, they're everywhere. <laughs> so I got my case for um, my father-in-law's flag. I have it sitting here on my um, TV stand because it wouldn't fit. I wanted it to sit right where that big frame is right there. wanted it to sit right there, but it won't fit now that it's in the case. So I think it looks good sitting there. And I think it should be proudly displayed. Um, it's been in a tote in a plastic case for six years now. And I think it needs to be displayed. So um, I also picked up at Hobby Lobby the shadow box sitting where I wanted the flag to go. There's nothing in it yet. Um, that's just the display it came with. But they had their shadow, some of their shadow boxes on clearance. Uh, it was only $12.50, $12 so I bought two of them. Um, don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. <laughs> but I have it sitting there to see if it fit. I think I need to move the shelf down one notch. Um, and then I was thinking for the bottom, I might, I need to measure that spot. And I may get a, um, a basket to put there to maybe hold... I don't know, maybe some extra dog toys, um, but of course have the basket so they can't get into it so they don't knock my stuff over. Maybe to hold an extra blanket, um, I don't know. I thought it'd look cute with a little uh, basket down there. So, yes, so now I need to go outside and pick up landmines and mow the backyard, hopefully. Because it was really long when we mowed it last and it really needs to be mowed again already. Um, trying to keep it shorter because like I said the dogs were bringing in grass clippings um, because it had gotten too long because it was rainy for a couple days so we couldn't mow it. So I need to keep that short so they're not dragging in grass. <laughs> so I'm going to go do that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video just kind of hanging out with me today. Um, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye. Why do you hate the lawnmower? Why do you hate the lawnmower? You need to stop. You need to stop. You need to stop. Oh my goodness. He hates the lawnmower. Okay, I gotta mow. I gotta mow. Okay?